guys, this is the red pepper case. Uh, I'm just going to do a little unboxing, then I'll do a water test for you. Um, so, I've already unboxed this once. Uh, I put it back in so I could do the video. Um, I've had it for like probably a little less than a month. I really like it. Um, so, overall, um, I really like it. The look of it. Um, so, the... The Kate, the box part, uh, like, it just tells you, like, all the specs, like, swim it, uh, waterproof to 6.6, .6, uh, feet underwater, uh, takes you through dirt, dust, sandstorms, mud, food, construction dust, um, st other stuff like that, um, yeah, so, let's get into the fun, well, the case, so, the actual case, I love a lot, so it the it obviously comes with a case. Then it comes with this little headphone jack thing. It so this makes your so you can still listen to music with headphones with your phone still being completely waterproof because it's got a little so this part it has little grooves. It has little grooves. I don't know if you can see that, but there's little grooves that screw into where this goes so that the phone is still waterproof. Your headphones are not, but the phone is. So, I thought that was kind of cool. Um, so, it comes with that. It comes with a little, like, cloth to clean the screen. And then, just, like, manual, like, um, water chest installation and then removal. Head Like, it talks about these. Um... Okay, so now that we've gone through this, let's actually get into the water test. So, well, actually, first I'm going to have to take the case off so I can get out the paper. Um, so, you want to take the little headphone thing out and then open the, the um, charging port. Then just put your fingernail or a coin in this little groove and kind of pull it open all the way around the edges until it just kind of comes up. Okay, so back, front. Okay, so this thing is just like stop, installation, checklist, everyday use checklist so you, like you don't completely destroy your phone. Okay, so I'm going to do a little test. I've got a bowl of water here. Okay, so I'm going to put a little piece of paper inside the case. Now I'm going to close up the case and put it in the water for a couple, like a minute or something. Okay, so, I'm just going to put this on. Sometimes you need to put it on a flat surface and kind of push down. You can hear it click all the way around, though. So you want to be sure that it clicks all the way around. And if you can't do a part, what I said before, put it on a flat surface and uh, push just with your, like, hand. Like, yeah, so I think that was the last. Yeah. And look around one more time just to be sure. And put the little headphone thing in and twist it really tight just to be sure no water gets in. Okay, so okay, let me move this so you guys can actually see it. Okay. And I'm gonna put the case in the water and just submerge it completely. It's completely in the water. These bubbles don't look like a good sign. Tip this up a little. That could be just trapped it, just in that little part though. So I haven't actually dropped my phone in any water yet. Like I, I got this case just because I kind of liked it. It looked kind of cool. I didn't really feel like paying eighty dollars for a real life, life proof case. Um, yeah. So this is actually looking pretty good. Okay. So I right, just move this. Let's get a paper towel to dry this off. Okay. So remember, there's like a little piece of paper in there to see if if it absorbs any water, then that means there was water in there. So, okay. Just making sure that all the edges are no water, so that if I do open it, nothing will fall into the case, and then the water, then the paper will absorb it. 
after we've taken it out of the water because that would be kind of stupid. Okay. So, I think it's, yeah, alright, it's almost dry. Yeah, it's probably good enough. Okay. So, now, like I said before, take off the headphone jack part. So, sometimes this gets really stuck, so you gotta, like, get something so your thumbs don't hurt after. And then, you can just unscrew it pretty easily. So, now, just, like I said before, un undo the USB thing. Now just kind of slowly take it apart all the way around the edges until it comes off like that. Now what I like to do is look around the edges and see if there's really water. So it gets into about here and then this little ridge thing right here it makes it so no more... Oh shoot, I just dropped the paper. Okay, so the paper has no trace of water at all. So that's a good sign. So there's nothing. Now let's look at the plastic. See, I don't see really anything at all. In the back. Yeah, no water at all. Okay. So that's been the red pepper case review. Um, so, hope you guys liked the video. Please like and subscribe. Bye.